We are live. Are we really live? YouTube's been shit in the bed. Let's see. All right, we are live. Hopefully this stays connected. All right. Thank you, Joanne. Appreciate it. Where the hell are we? Microphone on, start broadcast. Let's go on Instagram Live. What's up, Lulu? Yeah, there's no YouTube memes. What's up, Instagram? We're telling your followers that you've now started a live video, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, tell them. Friggin' tell them. All right, so what we got here, guys? We got a French toast. Oh, man. We got a French toast pizza from Brother Bruno's. French toast pizza. There's French toast, there's strawberries, there's icing, there's maple syrup on the pizza. We got this French toast-esque um, mix of stuff. Strawberries, potatoes, strawberries, hash browns, eggs, cinnamon, sugar. It's another sweet and savory mix. Um, how, how am I going to eat that? I don't know how I eat one thing without... All right, that makes more sense. That makes more sense. All right. What's up, guys? It is French toast everything time. French toast pizza time. Let's go. Hold on. Syrup gun. We need a syrup gun. Let's load this sucker up. Load this up. All right. What's up, guys? It's French Toast Pizza time. Let's go. Syrup gun. All right. Let's take a nice looking slice here. Here's a nice slice. Strawberries, French toast, maple syrup, icing. Oh, we dropped. Oh, shit. We dropped some French toast there. Anyhow. Cheers. Shout to Brother Bruno's Pizza Deli Bagel. That is good. That is delicious. Damn. All right. We also got, this is like, this platter is... I forgot to put salt on the flour. Salt that up. We got French toast pizza, French toast platter. French toast everything. You stop watching my stream, Shadow? This pizza is better than it looks. As you can see, it's got little pieces of French toast on it. 
Carbs, that's life. Carbs are life. Some people don't... I believe some people don't, like, really enjoy carbs that much. And those people are, like... 2% of the population... Like, maybe less. I can see you might not, you might feel that carbs make you fat. Or you might feel that carbs bloat you up. The second one to be true. But, to not like them? Nah, man. There's too much enjoyment in carbs. There's a reason why carbs are so popular. No, the pizza, I, honestly, the pizza looks good, but I feel like it could look better. You sub, thank you, R8, M8. Greetings from Turkey. What's up, Turkey? You know somebody from Turkey got pissed at me? I had a turkey sandwich. And somebody got pissed at me because I used a capital T. Speaking about my turkey sandwich. And they said, that's not the country, you asshole. And then proceeded to curse me out. I was like, okay. I get it. <clears throat> that person should not be allowed in your country. If they get mad about a sandwich, I'm from New Jersey. If they get mad about a friggin' sandwich. This is delicious. They should probably be put down. What's my favorite drink? Alcoholic beverage or regular? Mm -hmm. Shadow, you have a good night. People are sensitive, man. You know what? You want to know what's funny? How skinny... When I reach out this far, I look so skinny. Like this. This is like the worst angle for the internet. But if I sit like this... I look much bigger. Or like this. The people be like, oh, you're jacked. I go like this, people are like, oh, you got skinny. I'm just telling you guys. It's all an illusion. This platter. On the French toast pizza, there's French toast, maple syrup, icing, strawberries, cinnamon sugar. What's up, you have all that stuff. On this platter, there's eggs, hash browns, cinnamon sugar, um, a Greek yogurt, peanut butter, icing mix, um, salt, two pounds of strawberries. This platter is two, three, Almost five pounds this platter. Four pounds, 11 ounces to be exact. Let me guys drink over here.
Thank you, Joanne. Appreciate it. Shout out to Joanne. Um, Joanne lost 13 pounds on my diet. And she's just chilling. She's in no rush. She's eating more cereal than she probably ever has. She lives in Malaysia. Um, she's Chinese. They don't have the access to all the cool Amer uh, cereals that America has. She just got Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Joanne, you're 26, I want to say. You're 26 years old. Who are you asking me to shout out and why? They're huge fans. Who are they? Got some cinnamon sugar there. How many hours do I fast? As many as I want to. What's up, Club Doozy? As many as I want to, need to, or see fit. And then you eat accordingly. Just like if you don't do intermittent fasting. You eat accordingly. The magic isn't in... There's a lot of benefits to, to fasting. But the magic isn't... LeBron's the GOAT. LeBron can't make my sink shot, man. The magic... The magic of the weight loss isn't in the fasting. It's in the not getting hungry. And eating fat ass meals while maintaining a caloric deficit. It's not like too many people too many people think the fasting, if they just do fasting, that's what that's where everything is. All the answers. So, let's talk about something fun like 90s. Let's go back to the 90s when breakfast was the most important meal of the day. For some people, it still is. But within the next few years, you'll see that it's not. Within When science catches up. I eat so obnoxiously, but somehow it's what keeps you going. It can't be unseen. It can't be unseen. Once you see me, you can't unsee me. You could unfollow me. You could try to get away. But you're going to be looking for me. You know how many comments I get every day? Found him. This is the guy I was looking for. I've been looking for him for like a week. I was like... You don't follow me, but you remember who I am. And if you see me on the street, people will be like, you know my name probably, or the guy who eats all the massive meals intermittent fasting on the internet. I gotta follow you, man. Sunny D from the 90s. You guys want a drink? What do we got? Something up? Purple stuff? Sunny D? Sunny D? <laughs> Great commercial. <laughs> Any commercial. Yeah, everybody will come back sooner or later. <laughs> You just want to get into my post? Is that like getting in my pants? 90s commercials were like... The internet ruined commercials. Personally... 
Yeah. Does anybody else feel like the internet ruined commercials? Because nobody watches TV anymore, and if you do, it's like Netflix, and half the commercials are on the internet, half the commercials are on the TV, and nobody really cares. Like, like back in the day, you couldn't fast forward through commercials. You had to watch them. And you watch them over and over again. Um, they worked so much better then because you do you knew the name, you knew the song, and when you see it on the shelf, you're like, I've seen this friggin' ten thousand times. I make all my meals on Twitch. All my meals, recipes, ingredients, they're made on Twitch. Except this pizza, which is again from Brother Bruno's Pizza Deli Bagel. Um, yeah, man. Like, think about, like, toys back in the day. Polly Pocket. I don't remember how the commercial went. All I remember is Polly Pocket fucking... What else? My buddy, my buddy, my buddy, my buddy and me. Kid sister, kid sister, kid sister. My buddy, kid sister. Creepy crawlers. Creepy crawlers. They're squirmy. They're squirmy. They're purple and green. The biggest crawling creatures that you've ever seen. Creepy crawlers. Gross out your mom, embarrass your dad. <coughs> blah, 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 blah. We're not getting mad. Remember creepy crawlers? No, I understand Turkey is a country. And it's also a food. And an animal. It's all of them. And I understand that you live in the country, Turkey, not on the animal. I get that. So, what other besides creepy crawlers? Polly Pocket, my buddy, kid sister. Remember, skip it. Skip it. So, that stupid, that stupid, you put the, the thing around your ankle with the, with the rope and the ball at the end, and you would just hop up and, and skip it. Remember that shit? Remember Roller Racer? The friggin' red scooter with the handles? You would sit on it and swerve. Bulges in your cup? Yeah. Big part of waking up is bulges in your cup. Uh, I messed up the beginning. Bop it. Bop it. Simon. Um. <coughs> Thank you, Joanne. You have a good one. Bop it, Simon. Um, well, let's stretch Armstrong. I don't remember how it went. I think it was like stretch Armstrong. I could be wrong. Um, what else? Skip it, bop it, stretch Armstrong. I mean, typical GI Joe. Micro machines. Remember the micro machines commercial? Every time he came on, you tried to be like, micro it's not the real thing. That dude was legit. That dude was way before Twista and hip hop, <coughs> hip hop Twista. <coughs> the first mobile, why? <coughs> the first mobile phone? Save, 
<clears throat> now I'm choking on my fucking <clears throat> swallowed something wrong. Um, Saved by the Bell, they had that fake cell phone on Saved by the Bell all the time. It was this big. Super Soaker, Super Soaker song. All right, what about Super Soaker? Uh, slip and Slide. Remember Slip and Slide? Still popular. People have caught on and just started to use top um, tarps lately, but still slip and slides have their place. 90210, Sweet Valley High. Um, we named a bunch of these shows yesterday. The Fresh Prince in West Philadelphia. Um, what else? Silver Spoons, Growing Pains, um, if you're on Ramadan, you live where I live, you could eat, this is when you eat, it's dark out. Small Wonder? I don't know Small Wonder. The Facts Alive. The Facts Alive. We went over Who's the Boss yesterday. Yeah, Michael, we, we did the Michael Jordan Gatorade commercial yesterday. Mmm. Mmm. It was great. We talked about Ecto Cooler, Fruit by the Foot, Dunkaroos. Like, I remember when Hot Pockets came out. What you gonna eat? Hot Pockets! I remember when Lunchables came out. Remember that? When it first came out? Why buy real ham and cheese? Why not buy some like fake horrible ham and cheese? And call it a lunch. <clears throat> Lunchables. I'm trying to think of with other with other snacks. This is Dunkaroos. I mean, we had the goldfish and cheese it's which are still super popular. Did I hear the Kanye album? Different strokes. All right, good one. Oh, Kit Kat. Um, give me a break. Give me a break. Break me off a piece of that Kit Kat bar. Pizza bagels? You mean bagel bites? Are you talking about Dunkaroos? The kangaroos Dunkaroos? Or are you talking about animal crackers? I got animal crackers right here. If you had a, a packed Lunchable, you were a G. Chips, the TV show? Yeah, no. Chips was 80s, I believe. Cheers. Frasier. Seinfeld. Um, Seinfeld had the longest run of anything. Tom Cruise. Yo, Tom Cruise in Risky Business. That was 70s. Alexa. What year was the movie Risky Business? I'm having trouble connecting to the internet. Take a look at the help section in your Alexa app. Alexa, what year was Risky Business? Hey Siri, what year was the movie Risky Business? I don't really know. Alright, we just have like a bunch of useless chicks in the kitchen with me right now. Oh God.
87. Thank you, JTube. The, the Ritz with the little red stick. Oh! With the cheese in the square, and they had the crackers. And you would get the red stick, and you would dip it in the cheese and spread it on the crackers. What the hell were they called? What the hell were they called? If you post a fuckload of question marks one more time, you're blocked from my streams forever. Okay, dickhead? Stop ruining the stream for the people who are trying to type. You got my attention. Congested doors? What the hell is that? Those red sticks. They were awesome. You would just play with the red stick forever. Forever, you would just dip the red stick and scrape every little, like... It was more of a mental therapy and soothing thing. You would just... Once you pop, you can't... The fun don't stop. ba 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 bing ba 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 bing ba 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 bing ba 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 bing ba ba Yes, I'm aware it's Ramadan. Are you aware that I do intermittent fasting? No box? Yeah. You can after this. Hold on, let me blow my nose. Bing ba ba. What's on the front plate? I get people from Perth, Australia. I miss a comment. I will not be. Is that is that this weekend or next? If it's this weekend, I will not be there. If I get a cold, will I eat less? If I'm sick or... Well, first of all, I haven't been sick. June 2nd, I won't be there. Uh... I haven't been sick since, I want to say 2013, like legitimately flu since 2013, um, but I just use the principles that I always put out to manage my weight, whether No matter how you slice it, if you follow the basic principles, you can manage your weight whether you're sick, whether you're bedridden, you work out more, work out less. And I'm not saying, I'm not saying um, I'm not sick in four years because of intermittent fasting, but I used to get sick at least every year before that. I also managed my nutrition pretty well, despite what many people believe. So, what did I say? Back to the foods. Pringles. We watched Pringles. We watched Pringles come out. We watched a lot of these foods. Um, we had like... We didn't have that many cereals now. Cereal is friggin' huge now. We had like seven. We had Cheerios, Honey Nut Cheerios. We had Trix. Cookie Crisp. Cookie Crisp. Corn Flakes, Frosted Flakes. Wheaties. I think we had, I want to say we have Fruity Pebbles, but I don't even remember. 
And that was, oh, Fruit Loops. We had Fruit Loops, yes. Um, we had Honeycomb Pops. I gotta have my Pops. I gotta have my Pops. Pops are good. I said kicks. Eventually, eventually, we got berry berry kicks. Honey smacks. Okay, we have more than seven cereals. Thank you guys for reminding me. Cinnamon Toast Crunch. We also had, we also had the Keebler Elves. Hold on, this slice is stuck. Ah. We also had the Keebler Elves with the Nabisco cookies. Who are very hard workers. What else do we have? Those cookies are awesome. We had Chips Ahoy back then and Oreos. And the commercials were like, some of the commercials were like emotional for Oreos from what I remember. Like, they really, they really created, like brought out some emotions in people and made them, made them like nostalgic about Oreos. <laughs> and they need to do that. They don't even need to do it anymore because they, people just buy Oreos because of Instagram. But <laughs> I still think they should do it. Like, people buy Budweiser anyway, but that didn't stop them from doing the whole Clydesdale thing at the Super Bowl two years ago when, like, everybody was, like, brought to tears with the Budweiser commercial. Remember when they raised the horse and the horse, they had to give it away and then whatever happened and then he saw the horse years later and the horse, like, jumped over the fence and followed him home. And we were all like crying, like, that's what Nabisco should do with Oreos. Something like that, like, remember when you were a kid and you lost your Oreo and you lost it behind the couch and then years later you went to move and the last thing you went to move before you moved out of the house was the couch and you found that Oreo from when you were seven years old and you smelled it and it's still and it's still good. You still ate it. Like that's that's like a perfect commercial. I should sell that. I should sell that. What's up, Russia? Like the, the Christmas time commercials with Santa eating the cookies. <laughs> All that stuff. Who's going to eat this much food and go right to work? Come on, man. Bedtime. I'm trying to think. What else? What other commercials like really brought up emotions? What do I think about Czech and Republic? I think you asked me about nine times in the stream something about Czech and Republic. Chef Boyardee. And I, I thought Czech Republic was cool, but you're making it uncool because you keep asking me. <clears throat> Chef Boyardee. I don't remember where it rolls to the kid's house. What do I think about the Czech Republic? Do you want an essay? I like all countries, all nationalities, all people in general. I like trolls. I like haters. I like positive people. 
I like douchebags. Everybody's put on Earth for a reason. And whatever they decide to do or end up doing, that's fine. Everybody serves a purpose. Coke commercial, we get little boy jersey. I don't remember that. I don't remember that. Like, there, there are a lot of, like, racist people. First of all, I'm black and Italian. I'm African-American and Italian. I've dealt with enough bullshit in my life. I don't need friggin'... I don't need to hate on another nationality, race, creed, religion. Like, and there are, there are some places in America or areas where people are super sexist, racist, religion, sister, whatever. But I would say on the East Coast and West Coast, Northeast, New York, New Jersey, probably Connecticut, California, people are a lot more open because you have so many friggin' different cultures and races here, right here. Alright, hold on. <clears throat> Give it to Mikey. Mike, what is it? What was it? Mikey likes it or Mikey will eat it? I'm eating French toast pizza. That's all that's left. Mikey will try it. Mikey will try it. Oh, in the South, it's a little bit different. I get that. That's why I said Northeast. Mikey will try it. When the cereal nut and honey came out, I don't know if it's still out, but what's the undressed chef? Nut and honey. Nut and honey. What are you eating? Nut and honey. And the brand of the cereal was nut and honey. Will you tell me what you're eating? Nut and honey. And then she tur he turns around with the box. Oh. I remember that. Uh. But. Good commercials. Good commercials because you still remember them. Mm hmm There are racist people in New York, but it's hard, man. And you're talking more about New York State than New York City. Why, Sherry? Because I work 14 to 16 hours a day. And finally take a break, eat, and then go to bed and then wake up and do it again. You're a fat 15-year-old. Congrats, George. <laughs> if you'd like to lose weight, George, I recommend you look up calories in versus out. I can't sell you my program. I can't sell my program to minors. I barely sleep. Hiding your bags in the, when we walk around. I don't want to be a personal trainer. Um, I'm going to get into online training. Um, there's a lot of things coming. Online training is going to be one of them. 
Um, it's not going to be cheap at all. Um, and it's just going to be for people who really need me to, who are willing to pay a fair price for me to hold their hand every step along the way. Um, and there's only going to be a few people I'm taking because I got too much other stuff going on. Um, it's not going to be like, I only have 10 spots left. And you say that like every week. And you really have like unlimited spots left and no clients. It's going to be like, I really have like, I don't even think I would start with 10 people. Um, cause I have so much other stuff I'm doing, which you'll see soon. How do I it about Russia? What do you mean? How do I it? For you today. If they, if somebody tells you rice isn't allowed in your diet, your diet sucks. Yeah, rice isn't allowed. Buy the video. Person who just asked about rice, you're the first person I'm telling here, buy the video. <laughs> I eat every day. Eat rice, enjoy rice, lose weight. Eat your carbs, lose weight. Um, no, this was not all baked on the pizza together. I right, put the strawberries on after, but I did reheat it. Mmm. You got syrup coming out. Maple syrup dripping. Look, here's the thing with intermittent fasting. You work out as much as you want to. Is it dangerous for starters? No. You work out as much as you want to. If you want to. If you don't want to work out, lose weight without working out. It's a great weight loss tool. Fast as long as you want to, within reason. You pick the number of meals. You pick the number of meals, whether you want to count and track, whether you want to work out or not. It's choose your own adventure. I give you all the info you need. Put it together. <laughs> Appreciate it, Richie. Put it together. Make it fit your life. Eat carbs at night. Don't get fat. Okay, Kashmir. <clears throat> like Mike said, just buy the video. Nobody has any questions. I mean, some people have a few random weird questions after buying a video. But it's always random weird shit. Like if there's two trains, they leave the stop at the same time. One is going 60 miles an hour, one is going 50, and the one going 50 stops to pick up three pedestrians. Are you able to eat white rice and lose weight? Like those are the questions really. So, which is fine. Um. When the part of the question has nothing to do with the other part, it's like, yes, you're able to eat white rice and lose weight no matter what happens with the trains. 
It's like, oh. Don't confuse the correlation with the cause. Glad to hear, Kashmir. Cross the street and eat white rice while driving a minivan. You can. I wouldn't. If you do intermittent fasting, I'll tell you why. Eating while driving is the dumbest thing ever. And I've done it. I did it for years. Because you're scarfing down calories that you're not enjoying. Yeah, great plan, Doreen. What's the best type of workout to do? That was just the same question as if two trains leave the same stop, one going 50, one going 60, and the one stops to pick two people up, can you eat right rice and lose weight? That was exactly the same question. Whatever workout you want to do. <laughs> it doesn't matter. <laughs> whatever work, yeah, whatever workout you enjoy, like the undressed chef chef, you gotta enjoy it. If you're doing some miserable bullshit, It'll never last. You gotta enjoy it. You gotta keep going back. You gotta be consistent. Or there's no point in working out anyway. Just don't work out and lose weight without it. Um, I hate to be the guy who tells you, here's how to lose weight without working out. You don't even need to. But some people aren't going to. I always recommend people learn how to lose weight without working out by watching my video. And... Um, then, if you want to introduce working out to look better in the long run, feel better, put on some muscle, all that shit, then introduce it. <sighs> yeah, quick eats are not fun. <clears throat> Scarfing something down at a traffic light. I'm not... You're not enjoying it. Like, when I'm in the car, I like to count the calories I see people eating. I see somebody eating, I like to count those calories. Oven, store. And estimate how many they wasted at that traffic light. I also do that with people who chug protein shakes when, when they're on the treadmill after their weightlifting. Or when they chug a protein shake in the locker room. Um, I also count that. Like, this guy just burned 300 calories and just drank half of them back, literally. You too, the undressed chef. All right. <sighs> uh... No, I'm not trying to lose weight. I don't. I don't really care anymore. I'm just having fun, guys. I'm having fun. If I gain weight, I'm not really counting everything. If I gain weight, I'll I'll just do what I need to do to drop. If I drop weight, I'll do what I need to do to gain. And that's basically it. That's that's my version of cutting and bulking. Cause I just want to end up back at 200 pounds is where I'm at. So it doesn't really matter to me. It's really not important to me. I'm just freaking going out, partying, having fun, enjoying life.
enjoying a lot of food when out, doing friggin' some restaurant promotions, like so many random things, which are, yes, I guess a more, it, I wouldn't say more advanced, but more, I guess, careless, because I know, I know how to fix everything so easily. Um, well, if you want to lose weight, then follow the principles I put forth. Uh, I got to go to sleep because I have to be up in a few hours and get to work. Um, you guys all have a good one. I will, will I be on tomorrow night with Jenny? I may or may not be on tomorrow night with Jenny. Um, cause I got a big day Saturday and I don't know if I'm going to do a crazy meal or just an early, I don't know. We'll see. But anyhow, yeah, ETAB, you need to eat first before you can party with me. I only party with eaters, ETAB. You got to eat food. You guys all have a good one. Thank you for joining. Later, guys. Mmm.